My ping is deep frying. Okay, start shooting the machine guns. Yeah, get him stuck on his friends. Yep, yep, dogpile him. Get him, get him. Yeah, go. <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, see, these, these are those strategies. Um, this is how you become a, a pro gamer. All right now, they, they always say, say an effort to quick sell, but with scrap, because it's so easy to get, just get rid of that stuff. And look, now I'm at 700 coins. We're almost there. 2,000 more coins to go. Oh, yes. They don't- oh my gosh, deflation! No, the prices have gone down on them! Oh my gosh, that's what I get for not playing for like a few months. Hello everybody and welcome to a game that I've barely played on this channel before. I don't know why. Well, maybe. I actually do know why, but you know, it doesn't matter. <laughs> so yes, welcome to this game. Uh, you build cars in it and it's fun. I enjoy it. Let's go ahead and um... Check our daily challenges, of course. Wonderful. So we have to do craft any part on any workbench. Okay. Uh, we also need to win in one raid. Oh, okay. That's easy. My goal, however, is to obtain all of the artillery uh, uh, artillery pieces. Um, a long time ago, I used to have two of these. These are howitzers. And, well, we're going to be getting one of those in, like, the next month. So... All we need to do to get one is farm lots of resources and also sell those resources, which is annoying, but you know, I, I can do it. I've done it before with other things, you know, and then we'll need even more. So currently like the, the cost of these things, like this, this, is, this is one of them. Uh, we'll have to get one of these and then I can just buy the battle pass to get the rest of the stuff. So yeah, that's, that's the plan. And then after that's done, I don't know what we're going to do. We're gonna make like a helicopter with it or something. I don't know. <laughs> All right, let's see, let's see what raids are available. So we, we have frontier defense. That's a hard raid. Um, the only good raid is frontier defense, in my opinion, honestly, at least for tier two and for plastic. Uh, we could do the war for five. Okay, we'll just wait on that. So basically, your power score um, that determines who, who you're up against. So the lower your power score is, the worse the players are. Well, kind of, um, because everybody knows this strategy. There's a lot of other good players who go down to this 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 power score, which is 5k, which is uh, decent because you can actually get into matches with it. <laughs> so we're, we're going for some get the scrap, and hopefully my internet doesn't just go doo doo on itself or something. Oh dear. Well, let's, let's go ahead and see if we can get some wins. And I have 63 scrap metal, so I can actually get one of these challenges done. Ah, yes! Okay, so if I go to this faction, this is the engineer's faction, of course, and all you need to do is craft one of these, a cord. Yes. Look how many I have. I have 12 cords. Cords are the best weapon in this game, by the way. Um, I definitely get them, they're worth it. Now, as you can see, I did get I did get one of my daily challenges done, so now we only have to do raids! But I only do plastic raids, because anything else is a waste. Unless you're trying to actually, like, farm for resources. And now we're in a match. Okay, cool. Alright, let, let's go ahead and show these guys who we boss. I guess, maybe. Um, no, I'm not good at this game. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Hopefully my internet doesn't deep fry itself. Okay, so. The strategy is melee. Um, and, of course, I'm using machine guns. Because I am... I, I don't have any other gun to strap on this thing. <laughs> oh, crap. Um, this guy is in the way. Oh no. Or maybe I'm in the way. I don't know. I, I should avoid these people. I'm aggressive usually when I go. Um, especially with melee. I just like to drive in. Oh, see that guy? See that guy? He's gonna... Yeah, we got him with the spike. Okay, cool. And now time to shoot him. Look at that kill assist. Let's go! Oh, look at this action. Yes, my ping is deep frying. Okay, start shooting the machine guns. Yeah, get him stuck on his friends. Yep, yep. Dogpile him. Get him. Get him. Yeah, go! Oh, yes. Uh, see, these, these are those strategies. Um, this is how you become a, a pro gamer. Yeah. Uh, I'm getting shotgun from the side. Oh, oh crap. Uh, it's, it's, it's one of those. Oh, dear. <laughs> Man, I never thought this game would be so fun to record, but I'm actually, like, enjoying recording this. Like, I thought it would just be boring or I'm just going into matches, but I'm actually able to make some good jokes here, I feel like. Yeah, so I feel like I'm going to do some more episodes of this. <laughs> Oh, uh, look at all that metal we got for just killing one guy. Let's go. Oh, yeah, level up. I don't have the battle pass yet. And now here's the trick. So if you're going to do the battle pass, finish the battle pass before you buy it. It works. Trust me. It's good. Okay, see? 
Beca because then you don't have to dedicate yourself to every day going to beat the battle pass. Because you've already beat the battle pass when you go to buy it. Alright, so, th so the thing about this map is that it's, um... Th there's three bases we have to capture and secure, apparently. Well, we got A, B, and C. Now, I don't... Um, this map is confusing because usually you either end up rushing or just camping a base and having the enemy rush you. And never ever does anybody go through the center usually until somebody has captured a base usually. At least that's what I remember. Okay, yeah, I feel like um, this map is just like the fighting is so random on it. Like, you, you never know what you're going to get. It's like, oh, look at this guy. He, he's, he's melee as well, which is like the, the meta for this. Okay, he took off my, my buzz souls. I'm pretty much just a machine gun clown now. I'm pretty nubular now. Um, oh crap, my, my internet just deep fried itself. Okay, okay. Um, help this guy, help this guy, help this guy. Oh no, oh no, machine guns. Oh crap. Take him out. Okay, um, I feel like my, I, I just got shot. Okay, take this guy. Uh, uh, yeah, do that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um... Was I like the last man there? Holy crap, that was bad. Alright, now, they, they always say, say an effort to quick sell, but with scrap, because it's so easy to get, just get rid of that stuff. And look, now I'm at 700 coins. We're almost there. 2,000 more coins to go. Oh, yes. Uh, another thing. I, I'm, a, I'm a, prof a professional at farming, you know? Um, when, it, when it comes down to it, these engineer badges are very useful, so we need to get some of those. How do I get them? Uh, we need to complete 40 daily challenges. Oh, I can do that. Well, let me know down below. Wait, 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 what should I do? <laughs> Alright, th this map is always a, r a rush map. Anytime it's encounter, just rush the enemy. Like, just go straight for them. Um, now, if you're playing a howitzer, or like that guy is, uh, usually you want to stay, uh, stay back and just let all your friends go running in, usually. <laughs> um, okay, I I'm going up here, I guess. I don't know. Okay, I'm, I'm rushing in. Um... Uh, yes, I'm, I'm coming up behind this guy. Uh, that's... I, I'm getting shot. Well, I, I got him with my buzz saws, and now I feel like I might have spears in my... Okay, there we go. Okay. Uh, I think I got him. I think I got a kill here. Yep, uh, yep. Unless somebody else gets it before I do. Like, the the, dr the drone guy. Oh, no. Oh, I, I see there's... Oh, ah, I got this guy. You're welcome, buddy. Oh, crap. Well, I guess I don't have that guy. Uh, cannon bro, why, why you put them? Okay, okay. I, I, I've got him. I, I won't. Don't worry, I'll, I'll shove my buzz saws in this dude. Yes, good. Okay. Take him out. Take him out. Quick. Oh, two kills. Ah, oh, yes. Take that. <sighs> oh, three kills. Oh, yes, this is the best match ever. I'm down to one machine gun, but. Oh, oh okay, that guy's got him. Um, oh, okay, I'm down. Well, that's a good game. Good game. Man, this this might just be the best match of the day. Stats. Look, I'm top player on my team, but I'm li like the worst player to ever play the Let's go! 14. Oh, yes. We're, we're gonna get there. We are gonna get those done. Let's check our season. Okay, we got a lot more. But, you know, I, I will get this done. Okay. Okay. Uh, we need to do auto cannons next. Uh, okay. I'll need to find an auto cannon build or something. Wait, it says shotguns or auto cannons. Uh, I could throw these. Uh, well, how much do these even sell for? Also, oh, they don't. <laughs> oh my gosh, deflation! No, the prices have gone down on them. Oh my gosh, that's what I get for not playing for like a few months. Thinking, I'm gonna make an auto cannon build. That is good. I maybe no, it's gonna be bad. It's gonna be off. Uh, we need a medium cabin, don't we? Well, look at my selection of cabins. It's all garbage. That's the best thing for medium. <laughs> Which one is going to be the most tankiest cabin? 340 versus 290. Uh, looks like we're going bare then. I've been told not to use these things, but I do it anyway. <laughs> uh, engine in front. Because, you know, engines, they have a lot of durability. Check this out. They, oh, they've, they've nerfed it. It's no longer good for durability, I guess. What about this one? Oh yeah, that's that's got some good, good durability. Four hundred sixty-eight. That's decent. We got the we got the speedy tracks now. Should I go four or six? Four or six? Um, I don't know. Yeah, I'm probably making some of my friends angry by using all of these um, <laughs> small parts. 
and you may be asking, why would why would my friends be angry? Well, they, they always tell me not to use these um, smaller parts because number one, these are bad for your power score. It will make your power score go through the roof. For me, I just like shoving a ton of these parts here. I I, I don't know why I do it. I, I guess it comes from like building heavy for a long time. So like when you always build heavy and go for high power scores, um, you end up with like abominations that look like this. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, so usually the framework on things like these is like all the frames are super small. I can't even see the frames on this thing. But anyway, like, usually you just go for the smallest frames possible. And the reason why is because they're, they're lighter and usually easier to work with because you can shove more stuff in them. Um, but the thing is, the advantage is that, like, a bigger frame has more durability versus, um, you know, these. So, yeah. And some decoration to blend in with the new players. Oh yes, just spray that on there. Oh yes, and uh, of course we need to we need to make sure that we we don't forget this paint and the brown one as well. Okay, hold on, I'll see you guys after I finish painting. All right, that looks like some kind of weird buffalo. I, I well ant eater maybe ant eater. Does this look like an ant eater or what does this look like? It looks like a weird thing, like a maybe a crocodile from this side, but like. Before it looked like an anteater for some reason. I have no clue why. Like maybe maybe it's like some kind of weird beetle. I don't know. Yes. <laughs> I mean I completely understand how to build like a, a perfect build, but like I, I just don't care enough to build one. Oh hi there. Okay, my guns are gonna get shot off. Because I built badly. But you know, I'm a smart player. I'm gonna back off of the combat. Yep, see he's charging me. I think he's in melee. Potentially. Yeah, we might have melee coming in. Okay, we'll go ahead and approach the targets. Okay, here comes the machine guns. Why Why is my ping deep frying itself? Oh, look at this. My guns are blasted off. Okay, we're bad. Um, oh, dear. Here we go. So this map is, um, th there's three different pathways you can take, and there's, like, a section here in the middle where, like, everybody goes. Usually, all the fighting usually happens down that lane and that lane. And then sometimes you'll have a guy who randomly comes out one of the sides, um, but y you can't really... Oh crap, I just nudged that guy. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay, well here we go. Hopefully my... Okay, my internet's already deep frying itself. Wonderful. Well, I, I don't have machine guns, so I can't really be useful if my internet decides to um, take a, a real big deep fry on itself like it's doing right now. I'm... Oh, am I being shot by my teammate, or... Okay, cool, we're being shot by these guys. Well, I have a parser. I don't know what that's gonna do, but, um... I'm gonna use it on you. Yes. Can I take your guns? Ah, yes, I took a gun, maybe. Uh, I damaged, okay. Alright, here we go. This is the Goatman map. So, it looks like a Goatman face, but, uh, basically... You really only see people rushing for the center, um, unless you got Mandrake players, then they'll, they'll go for, like, the, the top areas, and sometimes you'll have a guy who just sits up there with machine guns, or, like, auto cannons, or, like, a kaiju or something, and then he'll shoot into the center of the map. Okay, I gotta make sure to be careful, because I don't want to accidentally bump into my teammates and ruin, ruin their game for them. Okay, uh, okay, here we go. So, yeah, a lot of times... Players will go back here. Oh, I forgot about this place. Yeah. Okay, so players will usually go back here, and then they'll just come out of nowhere and... Uh, look at that guy! Look at that guy! Take that! Ah! Yes, yeah, so, so the fighting is usually intense on these encounter maps, and they're pretty fun because of that. Um, I lost my gun, so I can't do auto cannon damage, but good. I, I got a guy, kind of. I did some damage. Man, uh... I, sh I should just use machine guns. I should just stick to that. Anyway. Here we go, we got Goliath Man. Okay, we got what? He's doing pretty cool stuff. Oh yes, he's using rapid fire machine guns, which are decent. Now Tank Man, he, he's got a weird build for a tank. So usually what you see on Goliath builds is not uh, cannons in the middle. Usually you'll see like a, a bunch of um, either buzz saws or like, you know, what are they called? Goblins or like the, the other things. Ruptures. I, or no, not ruptures. I forgot what they're called, but like they're, they're like goblins basically. Alright, we got a nail gun. Oh, that's just a bot. <laughs> Alright, this guy's using shotguns, which are pretty decent. And this guy, I forgot what he was using, but um. Wow, he survived that! Holy crap. Well, I mean, we didn't win, but uh, that was a good game, you know? 
Well, that was, that was a lot of fun, so I actually kind of enjoyed recording this. I didn't expect to, but, you know, I guess, hey, maybe I should do more of this, because I am enjoying it, which is fun. So, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Um, if you guys have enjoyed today's episode, you know, please consider liking and subscribing. If you guys got any comments, questions, or suggestions, leave them down below. And, hey, feel free to join my clan, because why not? Uh, we are gonna rebuild the clan and also kick a bunch of people out because they haven't been on a line in like a hundred years, so, uh, yeah. It's been a while and, um, yeah, we'll be getting back into the swing of this game, I guess. And then eventually we'll go to some other game. I don't know what we're gonna do next, maybe something else, uh, no clue. But next episode, I'll see you guys then. Goodbye.